Hey guys, what's up? Balboa here with part 2 of the 2008 Hess truck. Yep, 2008. Okay, just make it sure. Now, uh, I highly recommend seeing part 1 because you have missed the truck. So go see part 1 and then click back on the video. So, in this part, we'll be taking a look at this little scooper included. So we'll put this to the side. And take a look at this little guy. And I can say this little guy is pretty awesome. Uh, he does have the 2008 uh, tattooed on the bumper, and this is, I believe this is the first kind of construction vehicle we've gotten in the Hess line. I'm not a Hess expert at all, but uh, I believe so. Now this little guy has a lot of really cool things going for him. For one, he's the first ever motorized Hess. Oh, uh, that's the light. Uh, here's the motor gimmick. Flipping the switch here causes the back wheels to spin forward. And pushing it back causes it to spin back, and you just put it in the middle to switch stop. And this light, this works even if it's light lit up. And don't worry, I will sh do the whole night thing. But this is really cool because you can do stuff like this. Okay, this is the kind of stuff you can do with this toy. You can have the little Hess pull the f the big Hess forward, and that's. That's awesome. That is so cool. This dude's like a powerhouse compared to the other Hess because he's motorized. Uh, that does mean that over time his gimmick will kind of deteriorate. And it doesn't affect the rolling that actually. Yeah, it, it, it does. I thought it was just the mouse pad over here. But yeah, it really affects it. To the point where you can't really roll it. You just kind of got to pick it up and use your imagination. Yeah. But, uh, yeah, so, uh, this thing does have a crane on that fully extends, uh, out it, and up. So you can have that at different angles, you have it forward. And it doesn't change, the, this, this is really heavy, so it doesn't, so you can, you know, put, actually put stuff in here and it really won't, ch uh, change it. So, uh, yeah, it does bend backwards a little bit and it extends this high up and it goes this far forward. This expands, uh, extends down and it's on a very very nice ratchet both of these joints are well this one's kind of a ratchet like very tight tight kind of silent ratchet this one's actually a loud ratchet uh, I hit the switch it's kind of easy to hit the switch when you're messing with this but that's understandable and uh, n this arm doesn't light up at all now you can actually uh, push the button here and have it dump so you can put an item in here like like a screwdriver I can get this in frame and have it dump it. Now I wouldn't recommend actually putting rocks in there. Just put like fake toy. I mean, a uh, rocks or dirt. Just put fake plastic toy rocks or dirt in here, because you don't want to get this dirty. Very cool. It has chrome, kind of a chrome engine here, which is very nice. And the tires do say Hess, by the way, along with a little H mold in there. Now uh, we're going to take a look at this in the dark with all of the lights on. So let's do that. So there is the Hess with all of the lights on. You can see, very cool, very lovely, very cool. I like the uh, headlights, how it says Hess and then you have the headlights there. And then you have it on top and very cool. I really like that detail. It is a really good thing I'm not afraid of the dark because of all the night shots I've had to done do with this. And it doesn't matter if the lights are on, the gimmick will still work. And I just love it. It's so cool. Now, uh, yeah, the gimmick is kind of annoying, and it is a little bothersome because he doesn't roll well, but it's still really cool, and you can do stuff where you have, you can have him kind of drive into him, into it, so, right, let's do that. So you could do that, which is pretty cool. And uh, yeah. So uh, my final thoughts of this set is that this is a phenomenal set. I love the Hess. They're just phenomenal t uh, collectibles. Not even toys, they're collectibles. And this is just a phenomenal piece to add to your Hess collection. Uh, if you're not really into this stuff, then don't really pick it up. I would definitely pay like 50 bucks for this, considering you're getting an actual motorized Hess and this huge kind of dump truck. And the fact that it does that is freaking awesome. So, 
50 bucks for this thing, you will not be disappointed. Remember, this is a limited edition item. It's released only during 2008, only during Christmas, and it's a promotional piece. So you're gonna have to pay. You're gonna pay a lot, but you won't be disappointed. I just really recommend this thing. It's just such an awesome set. So until uh, then, stay tuned for some more reviews. Adios.